If you want to have something that stays on the video whilst the video is playing, we still work in this motion environment that we're in. I find the point in the video and I'm going to select one of my tools. So I could add an image or here we're going to use an emoji. So I either right click or hold down a left click to choose the emoji I want. Then I left click to place it onto the image. If you now right click, it changes your mouse to a selection tool, which is really useful. So you can resize this or position it around as needed. Now that we've added that static shape, we can see a start and an end point for that on the video. So if I press play, I can see where it is. If I wanted to turn it off there, I'll just click and drag to move this back. Then when I play it, I'll see the emoji coming at that point and it will move after there. As with everything on your timeline, on your uh, drawing timeline that opens up here, you can always show and hide elements. So if I played this again without the motion, we just see the thumbs up. If I show the motion and hide the static shape, we just see the motion.